Hi everyone, welcome back for another tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to create a text but with Chrome effect. Yes, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a new file. I'm happy with this. I'm going to just grab uh, color so I can do a nice gradient. Yeah, this should be fine actually. Select gradient tool and uh, I'm going like so. Okay, so at least we're not just looking into white. Uh, so I'm going to grab the text and I'm going to write Photoshop and I'll click OK. Well, let's select Move Tool and Control A to select all, or you can come here, select all, and right here on the top, I'm going to put this in the middle and I'll deselect and you can deselect right here deselect so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to hide the background layer and I'm going into the channels if you don't see the channels right here just go into window look for channels click and it will appear and I'm going to select um, a channel and they will just about the same so it doesn't matter I'm, so I'll duplicate duplicated this channel and I'm going into filter and I'm going to add just a bit of blur a Gaussian blur, just soft, soften slightly this text and I'll click ok but probably a bit too much, let's see uh, yeah this should be fine, I'll click ok so back to my RGB, back to my layers now we have a new layer on top of that one and uh, we're going to fill with the uh, 50% gray. You can come here into Edit, Fill, and go 50% gray, or you can Shift, Delete. And now we're going to apply a very, very cool filter. I really like this filter. And that will be in Render, so Filter, Render, Lighting Effects. And we want to add a bit of light to this a bit more like so and right here on the bottom we have texture we're going to click and it will show blue copy which is actually the one we've done just a couple of minutes ago and I'm going to add a bit more right here perfect and I'll click OK as you can see it looks very cool and it was very simple to do so now image adjustments and curves and let's just play with the curves right here on the first one we take it up right somewhere around here some like so but we can adjust it afterwards if we want like on the second one we bring it down like so and now on this one here we'll take it up to the same level as the other one and right here on the other one we'll bring it down and this one here will bring it down as well uh, let's take it a bit up let's see like so like so and see and it kind of looks okay to me yeah it looks alright so now what we do? Simple. We click and hold Alt and between the text and the top layer we create a clipping mask and there we go. Chrome effect, different shades so it, it varies because Chrome varies depending on the light. But there we go. And if you'd like if you'd like you can always uh, uh, merge this visible, so hang on a second so merge visible and we can add a layer style like drop shadow only a small bit of drop shadow and uh, a stroke a very small stroke as well one two three, add yeah, three looks cool and there you go 
Chrome effect uh, in Photoshop created in a couple of minutes. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye for now.